So we made it to Hong Ding Fang Hot Pot. This is recommended by our hostel. We had hot pot once before in Guilin. So hopefully this one's really, really good and we're gonna enjoy it. So, one sliced beef, one fresh pork belly, a cauliflower, and one needle mushrooms, oh, one boneless chicken soup. Was that it? So the woman came along and she gave us these red cans. Um, we don't know what to do with them. Not at all. So the way that you're gonna eat all of this food is it comes uncooked and then you put it in the big pot in the middle, you let it cook in there and then you eat it. And this has two different kinds of soup that you can cook in. One of them is super duper spicy, which is the one that's like known for the area. And then the other one is a bit milder, so that you don't, if you're a tourist like us, you can cope. Jenny's already tried a little bit of some things. She says it's really spicy, and I just lick my fingers, and it is really spicy. Love cauliflower. Dipped in there. Super tasty, but it is just like, Chili, 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 and it really, like, I really like spicy food, but this is hitting me actually. One of the stranger things we ordered was chicken speed. They're boneless, so that makes it a bit easier to eat. Belly pork. It looked quite weird on the menu and it came and it looked even weirder. It looks like this weird pile on a pile of ice. I don't think it's going to be belly pork like we're used to, like with loads of meat on it. It's just like pork skin. skin. So I'm not sure how it's going to be. It's quite expensive, so we're going to have to go for it. I'm going to put it in. I'm going to go for it. It looks very odd texture. It is a weird texture. It's a bit chewier than I expected. I suppose it looks quite chewy. Um, I don't know, it's hard to tell, what, to tell you what it tastes like. Everything tastes very peppery. Everything just tastes a lot like brown peppercorns and chili peppers. So Jenny's had to go and go to the toilet to wash out her eyes. She's got some chili in her eye and it's really burning, it's really hurting her. been crying and crying the whole way through the meal so hopefully she can wash it out and she'll feel a bit better. How are you Jen? Uh, the spice is like really getting to me and I've been like crying off my makeup steadily this whole meal. I don't think this is my favourite like it's a little bit too spicy for me to be honest. What's your verdict then? I think I'm glad we had the experience. We had hot pot in the place that hot pot is from and we had the spicy one that you meant to have but I think it's probably not going to be something we order a lot. It's just like a fat. I don't really like cooking my own food anyway. I always find it a bit faffy and I feel like you don't cook it as well as if someone else did it. And then it gave me ordered kind of weird stuff. So we didn't really like that much of it. So it's okay, it's an experience. But overall verdict is like, it's not up there with our favorite food. So what do you want to do now? Uh, I think we should pay and go get like another milky drink to like calm my mouth down and then head to the people's park. We made it to Chengdu People's Park and we weren't expecting this but they've got a whole fairground here with loads of different rides and food and loads of things like that. Chinese, but we translated one and it 
listed out like how tall someone was, the kind of um, the age, their education, education, their parents were retired or working, and like what their job is, and like their temperament. So I think they're kind of like lonely hearts out there, and you can call the number and meet up with them. There's so many people here just mingling around, I don't know if they're all meeting up, whether some of the notices are from them. Um, but it's just so so busy, just mainly retired people. Yeah, I want to know how many people meet this way, it's very interesting. When we first time. got there, it was kind of like boring music, and yeah. then it turned into like clubby, dancey music. So sweet though, how really cute, cute is that? We've had a really great day today, seeing the pandas, mm -hmm. and having a hot pot, even though it wasn't our favourite. It's a good experience anyway. Yeah, and now coming to the park, we're pretty knackered though, because we didn't get much sleep, we went to bed late, got up early, which we always do. Uh, so we're pretty pooped, even though it's only like 4pm. <laughs> so we're going to end the day here and head back to our hotel.